What's up guys, Fishing with them back with another video and today we're going to be talking about the top 5 pre-spawn baits to use. Let's get into it. Now before we get into this video, make sure to hit that like button and subscribe. Alright, the first pre-spawn bait that we have is a deep diving crankbait. Now, this is kind of going into winter into pre-spawn, but more likely when you're in pre-spawn, the bass are not going to be like totally up on the shore. They're going to still be a little bit down low so you're going to want to have a deep diving crankbait to get down to those deeper parts where the bass are stacked up now you want something bigger because the bass when they come out of hibernation they're they're going to want something bigger than just what you would be throwing in the winter like a little like a little worm or something or like just like a micro crank crankbait the next one on our list is a jig. This is for a hungry fish, just like me. I'm pretty hungry. I could eat this right now. I'm not going to. Uh, but this is for a big bass that wants to eat something right away when they come out of pre spawn because it's, they're going to be very hungry. They haven't had anything all winter and they're going to be looking for a bigger meal than what you would be throwing in the uh, winter or most most of the year like smaller fish the next one on our bait or the next one on our list is a stick bait this is not a stick bait stick bait all right so i like this color because it has that yellow tip and i think it just entices the bass just a little bit more than what a, just like a whole brown stick bait would look like but I like to rig this weightless and then basically this is for the stick bait for pre-spawn is for finicky fish that are just down like like during pre-spawn they're like down not on the bottom but down just a little bit lower that are finicky and they just don't want to eat but if you put this long daddy in front of their face they're going to want to eat that the next one on our list is a spinnerbait now you're probably asking like what what blades do we use because i know spinnerbaits have like silver blades uh silver and gold they have a bunch of different blades blades uh but the best time or the best pre-spawn blades for spinnerbaits is gold and silver a little bit of bling a little bit of flash but anyways what you use this for is bumping along rocks and lay downs and this will give a little bit of flash to make the bass more interested also another um bigger bigger profile than what you would be throwing like during the winter the best thing about free spawn is you got to know that you want something not small you want something bigger because the bass are going to be hungry coming out of the coming out of hibernation they're going to be hungry all right the last one on our list is this uh, little minnow fluke now this can be used for pre-spawn and spawn because when you're in spawn the the bass are on beds and if you see a bed pull out this this uh fluke and you put like a little bullet weight on it and then you just put that on a bass's bed it's going to act like a minnow eating it so you're going to want so so the bass are going to are going to end up eating this because it, they think it's a minnow on their bed eating all their eggs now for pre-spawn you want to fish this shallow underneath docks and lay downs where the bass will be or more towards the bottom like the lay downs towards the bottom Th those are all the baits that i got i hope you go out during pre-spawn use some of these baits catch some biggins and thanks for watching make sure to hit that like button and subscribe